Hello my beautiful co-creators, this is Isolde Kellerman from Journey of Awe and this is day 10 from my 40 day journaling challenge. The universe has a funny sense of humor because I'm pretty sure everyone who's doing this challenge you've been noticing probably that you are having more and more negative experiences that you have to overcome and keep calm. And frankly that is one of the ways that our desires or raising our bar happening. It's called the echo um, in the spiritual world, which means when we are ready to let go of an old belief or pattern, it comes back to us and tests us that are we ready to raise our bar and how is our reaction to it. If we say yes to an old pattern and react the same way, it means we are not ready to move on to the next level. And this, um, what I call the universe has a funny sense of humor because the more you desire something to change, the more challenges will come to you to test you. Are you really deserving or ready to really have that change come into your life? And, um, and there was a few times that I feel a little bit shaken, but the main thing was that I recognized it, awareness, and I went to my breathing exercises and I went to my mantra. And frankly, just remembering, guys, that every moment, just for example, when I started this video uh, one minute, 47 seconds ago, it's already the past, okay? It's a done deal. You cannot change that. But how you feel about it, that's what you can change. And every minute is a new beginning. So don't beat yourself up if you lost it or you got trapped into something negative. Move on. The next minute is the new possibility, is the new because we are creating in every single minute. And the faster we can let go of guilt, the faster we can let go of of any negative, destructive feelings or thoughts, then the faster we go to the next moment and bringing or kind of pulling power from that moment um, and so on. So the miracle of the day was today is smiling at strangers and seeing their reaction. It's contagious. And I look at smile as saying hello without words and when you put an emotion behind a mimic, a face mimic, you know what, it's one of those statements that I really truly loved, um, I'm not sure if you guys seen the movie in Avatar and their way of saying hello was I see you and the same way when you smile someone with an intention of saying hello or or sharing your uh, feelings of love, it is like a recognition in the other person's eye and they say hello back without words. Try this exercise and see what kind of reactions do you get. And I can guarantee you 100%, I never had someone who was upset me smiling at them. So my experience is 100% joy and love. And one of the qualities that I like about myself, well, I am very hard-headed. Born in April, Aries. So I go at things and I get it done and how fast can I get it done and how fast can I learn and, and love challenges. I think that's my middle name, challenge. But um, anyhow, I am determined and when I get something in my mind to get it done, I will get it done because I have to prove it to myself. So anyhow guys, smile. Remember those trying um, experiences. The more you're trying to change something, the more the old patterns will come back, which is the echo. It's simply a self-test. The universe is a mirroring effect, so no one is testing you, testing yourself. And, um, and happy journaling. See you guys tomorrow.